Hi, it's Gary. Welcome to day 25 of the Diamine Ink Vent calendar. We've made it through to the end of the month. It's time to dig in and see what's behind that last door. Well, this one, it's easy, isn't it? There's only one door left. Here we go. Day number 25. This is the larger bottle. Let's dig in and see what we've got. So here we go. It's a standard Diamine label and it's called All the Best. And by the look of it, it's like a dark red burgundy type colour. Let's get the calendar out of the way. Let's take the wrapper off this bottle. So the wrapper's off. Here we go. Diamine, all the best. What a lovely name, isn't it? Now, on the side of this, it doesn't actually tell us if it's a shimmer or a sheen. But we can get a hint. If I turn it over to the back, you can see I'm going to call that a purple or maybe a dark pink type shimmer. Hopefully there'll be a sheen in it as well. I do love the name All The Best. I think that's awesome, especially when you consider, you know, Christmas Day. All The Best is great. I'm going to give the bottle a good shake, then I'll fetch in my swatch card. So there you are. Nice and mixed. Let's open this up and then fetch in the swatch card. So as usual, I'm using a colouring card. First tool to use today, it's that Pilot parallels with a six millimeter blade so let's dip it in and let's see what we've got wow that is nice isn't it so yeah i'm seeing there we've got that gorgeous i'm gonna say dark red maybe dark crimson or burgundy type color Do you know i'm just gonna sound really weird what this reminds me of many years ago my sister-in-law she had an old Chesterfield uh, three-piece suite. And this reminds me of the colour of the leather. Single pass down. No, we don't. I'm jumping ahead. I've just dipped one more time. I'm going to give a nice thick coat in there in the middle. And now, a single pass down the side. Fetch in the Serendipity dip pen. So, in it goes. Diamine ink vent. My fingers, oh, I've got ink all over. Ink vent 2021, day 25. All the best. I've even got it onto my little bit of corkboard. I think that means I'm going to have to change that. Just going to move this out of the way. Let's give that plenty of time to dry. I'm going to just dab up where I've got that excess ink. I don't really want to get that onto my endless recorder notepad. There we go. I suppose in a way, having ink stains on here adds a little bit of character to it. I'll now fetch in my endless recorder notepad. This has got 68 GSM Tomoe River paper. Just giving the bottle another quick shake. Make sure that Shimmer's got its best chance of getting all the way around. Here we go. Go dip the pen in one more time. So, ah, it's day 25. All the best. Drying times, immediate. 10 seconds, 30 seconds, Oh, I'll have to dip again, finally one minute, after a minute, it's still fairly wet isn't it, do my writing sample, Oh, we've run out just before I get to that last word. Just very, very quickly re-dip that. There we go. You can have to see the difference between a fresh dip and where it was running out of ink. I'm just going to move this to one side and leave it to dry. Whilst it's doing that, I'm going to go and wash my hands before I do anything else. Hopefully get the worst of this ink off. I mean, it's made 
quite a mess of my hands. I think the bottle must have had a leak. So I've given my hands a good clean now. Let's take a look what's in number 25 of the Star Wars, The Mandalorian, The Child Advent Calendar. Day 25, another easy one to find right there in the middle. Let's open it up. Let's see what chocolate there is for my wife. Here we go, just using this to get in easier. And let's ease this out. Hopefully it hasn't melted and it hasn't. Here we are. Well, I'm not sure what that is. What do you think it is? I'd love to know. Oh, there we are. If I turn it the right way around, we can tell. It's Santa's sleigh being pulled by the reindeer. I'll pop that to one side. Let's get rid of this now. So I thought I'd jump to my face for a couple of minutes whilst we give that swatch time to dry. So I've got my Christmas t-shirt on. Here we are, bar humbug. What better sentiments can there be? At the start of the month, when I did my bit to the camera, someone asked why I wasn't wearing a, an ugly Christmas jumper. Well, over here in Australia, it's the summer. Today, the forecast is for 41 centigrade. That's roughly 106 Fahrenheit. At the moment, it's 28 centigrade, which, looking at my calendar thing, is 82 Fahrenheit. So it's too warm to wear a jumper. Anyway, this is where I would be normally opening the gift for my wife. But when I came in to record today, the table, it was empty. Well, I don't want you to be sulking all day. Oh, thank you, dear. I, she's brought it in personally today. Anyone would think we'd set that up. Let's take a look what's in here. I'll just reach for my scissors. So, it's got nice sized bots there, isn't it? I'm going to try and open this and keep it on camera. That's going to be a bit of a challenge. I don't want to rip the paper, I might be able to reuse it. Right. I'm gonna to have to rip it. There we go, let's see what we've got. So we've got a white box. Pop that out of the way. So here we go. There we are, we can get in camera. A white box. I'm going to slowly open this up. Let's see what's in it. Oh, it's an OT. No, maybe not. Oh, it's a pilot. <laughs> I wonder what this could be. I don't know how she's managed to get a pen without me knowing. Let's take a look what's inside this box. Again, I'm just going to take the lid off. Ah, there we are. We've got some black sponge. And under that black sponge... I've just dropped the card onto the floor and another couple of bits. We've got a pen. Just going to ease that out. It's in a plastic wrapper, so I'm not going to take it out of the wrapper. It's a Pilot Custom 823. Wow. <laughs> I don't know how she knew I would, that I wanted one of those. Maybe it's the fact I've been dropping hints for a long time. What I'm going to do, I'm going to be very good. I've just popped that back in the box. I'm actually going to leave it until after Christmas. And then what I'll do is I'll record a full unboxing with the aim of getting that out early in January. You know, I think I'll get in trouble if I spent half a day playing with a pen. But you never know. I might get permission. I might not. Anyway, that's enough of my face. I think this swatch is now dried. So let's switch back down to the top view. So let's fetch in that swatch card and my writing. Here we go. There it is. So looking at the swatch card, I actually like this. So we've got the red colored there, which is the background. But then hopefully if this catches the light, I can see we've got like a gold shimmer there. But then let's look in the middle and we've got this gorgeous. I'm going to say that that shimmer, it's a blue sitting on top of the gold sheen, sitting on top of the red. That's really nice, really different. And certainly, I'm going to struggle to find inks that look like it. Before we look for those, though, let's take a look at the chromatography. Here we go. So we've got down at the bottom, I don't know, would you call that a lilac type line? That's where I actually put the ink on. We're coming up then into pink. Then we've got some orange. Then we've got that really dark crimsony red. Looks quite nice. As I said, 
I'm going to struggle to find some comparisons. Nearest I can see, I've got Diamine Red Dragon. With this one, slightly lighter than the background colour, but getting towards it. From the 2019 Inkvent calendar, I've got Diamine Mulled Wine. Again, that background colour, that's where it's similar, but there's absolutely no sheen in there or shimmer. The final one I'm going to fetch in is Colt Pen's Little Bob. Strangely enough, made by Diamine. That looks like there's a little bit of that similar background colour. And then we've got that gold sheen to it. But again, no shimmer. So quite unusual ink for me. Let's take a look at the writing. As you can see, it's very, very wet. We start off after a fresh dip, really dark, but it soon leaves a nib. And then we come down to this nice red colour. Just to see if I can get any of that shimmer coming through not really i need to take a better look in better light you know it could be that it's looking more of the black side especially there on the word make that's where i can see a little bit it could also as i say be the lights i'm looking at so this is the final day day 25 of the diamine ink vent calendar for 2021 all the best and i wish all the best to all of you